everyone, it's Natalie. Welcome to my channel. I'm so excited about today's video. I get to take you guys along with me as I do some Christmas decor shopping. So mostly I'm just gonna be sharing what's out there, taking a look, kind of doing some window shopping, but along the way I'm gonna find a couple of things and share it with you in sort of an affordable or mini haul towards the end of this video. You guys know I like to keep things practical, minimal, affordable, so you're gonna get that with this video and when I went on Instagram, I asked you guys what you wanted to see, which stores you wanted me to visit, and the top votes were for Marshalls, Michaels, and Bath and & Body Works. So that's where we're going in this video. Last night, my mom and my sister and I actually headed into Marshalls and found a huge selection of amazing Christmas decor for really, really good prices. So I'm gonna share that with you guys first before Haley and I, she's back there, we're gonna go to Michaels here and take a look at what they have. But before we head into any store, I would just like to remind you guys that you don't need and I don't need any of this stuff. This is just extra. It's fun to shop. It's fun to get into that Christmassy mood, but definitely stay within your own budget and do what's practical for you and your family. Other than just getting into the Christmas spirit, another reason I love doing some Christmas decor shopping is to really just get some inspiration. And maybe I will pick up a couple of things, but I love being able to reuse my collection of decor that I've had for years and years. I encourage you guys to do the same thing. I'm a huge advocate for that and I think it just adds a sense of tradition and hominess to the decor that you set out but we are gonna go check out what's at the stores first of all I am going to share with you what we found at Marshall's it was amazing and I will see you back here so we can head into Michael's okay first of all I'm excited to say goodbye to all of this hello to some Christmas stuff. We're like lost in a sea of Christmas stuff. Like I don't even know where to start. This store has way more than I expected them to. I was here last week and they had a third the stock they do right now. And mom is looking at Christmas towels over there. Oh man, they have all sorts of stuff. Judah is terrified of nutcrackers. Aww. He just, <gasps> he thinks they're so creepy. So I don't think we'll be doing nutcrackers this year. These are really cute. These cute little wood round snowmen. Like champagne colored. It's like a gold champagne. Yeah. So it's pretty. Like the I'm not really into like the glitzy side of mm. Christmas, but this makes me kind of want to be. This is so yeah. pretty. Yeah. Love it's that. Gorgeous. I like a little sparkle. These tree toppers are just figurines. Oh, just figurines. <laughs> Those are cute. Oh, and then they have on their like wall hangings, little area, a lot of different little things for Christmas yeah oh yeah that's really cute I like that we wish you a Merry Christmas that's really cute oh my gosh so cute how much is that 15 and then is this like the same artist I think it is cute little dough that is so cute oh my gosh I'm so excited about this I've been looking for black and white gingham um, wrapping paper and this is so much cheaper than they had on Amazon. $2.99 a roll, and these are like good size rolls. That Except almost Mary feels sacrilegious. Like <laughs> oh my gosh, oh, gnome Jesus. Mary and Joseph and, I mean at least Jesus That's is cute. not a gnome. <laughs> He's got a little tuft. This is cute, oh my gosh. That is really cute. So yeah, this is like the plush decorations area. How cute. We've got the gingham. Gnome. Oh yeah, look, a gingham gnome. He's a it's giving them everything. Cute. Everything seems to be this black and white gingham, which I do a little bit of. I like touches here and there. Mm -hmm. I know people go all out with like the black and white gingham. It's everywhere. Um, I am picking up some of the little uh, uh, wrapping paper, but I mean, they're just throwing black and white gingham around a candle just to be like, hey, we have black and white gingham too. We're trendy. And they have Hanukkah stuff too. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I love that. Those deer are pretty. I know. Look at that velvet. Very, very so pretty. Haley would go crazy. She loves pillows. This is cute. This is so Look at all those. See the black and white yeah. gingham. It's everywhere. This is tis the season to be cozy. That's so cute. Oh, someday I want to have a Christmas village like the whole shebang. My grandma has an amazing one. 
but they have cute stuff here for that. Oh, how cute is this? Oh, the boys would love this so oh, that's much. So cute. Seeing a lot of this galvanized metal decorations. It's very farmhousey. Oh, nice. How many? You know what? I don't either. They're just. I should check out what they have dingy. over there. Oh, I like that gray. That's really pretty. So pretty. Yeah. And then. Oh, cute. Very cute. I love that. Look at this. Anna and I were just looking at this. They have little peanuts going stuff. Oh, yeah. I want to look over there then. Oh, gosh. This is so cute. Oh, my gosh. Lots of Christmas sheet sets. These are super cute. They have so much. Christmas tacos. Mom, there's Christmas avocados. Feel them. Oh. Yeah, they're like woven, like mohair almost. 20 bucks. Wow. 19. Oh, I really, oops. Oh, sorry. I know, I saw this. I, I thought really like this. It's like really, You know really me so well. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's, of course, the plush ones, which I want to find a cutesy one. Oh, this might be cutesy. Oh, Look at that. The kids loved having the fall blanket. Oh, they'll love the snow. How cute is that? <laughs> Christmas llamas. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Anna loves llamas. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so cute. I love those. Any hedgehogs? There's penguins. Oh my gosh, too cute. Oh my gosh, I, that's my favorite so far. Sad. Mom, I found it. <gasps> what the heck? Oh, it's so cute. Oh my, oh my gosh. And look, it has, a little hedgehog it has Christmas, Christmas lights, lights on it. it. Okay, forget you penguins. <laughs> As if they didn't have enough pillows on the other side of the store. Right? They have more yeah, up okay. here. Wow. This is too funny. All the different personalities. Cool kid reindeer. Glam reindeer. <laughs> hipster reindeer. Oh my gosh, I should show Weston that. That's hilarious. And they even now have Christmas stuff on the clearance section. This is cute. Santa gnomes are very popular right now. It looks like all sorts of Christmas doormats. This, this is a Peanuts one. Oh my gosh, how cute. So this is a good place to get candles. I am probably going to go to Bath and Body Works just to check out their Christmas stuff. But they have some good stuff, some stuff down here too. Look at all these candles. Oh my goodness. Those shelves are like leaning forward with the weight of the candles. Oh, we're just huffing candles over here. Four Christmas trees now. Oh yeah, that smells so good. I love that. Well, oh, come to the store. I love finding stuff like this in a store. So sweet. Mom once again finds herself at the chocolate aisle. <laughs> Look at this, Mom. What? You found one? Oh my gosh. It's so cute. <laughs> yeah, forget Winnie the Pooh. He's outlawed in some places. Medium glasses. I know, it's so cute. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. I don't give a fuck. The amount of times hilarious. I said, yeah, like a caramel frappuccino, and then I said it so many times. Oh my gosh. Starbucks barista, ladies and gentlemen. Those look like retro. Love it. <laughs> Mom, you should be the thumbnail. So the takeaway from going to Marshall's yesterday was that they have excellent stock and I actually talked to the gal who rung me up and I was asking her like is this typical for Marshalls to have this much stuff and she said yeah this year Marshalls is crazy stocked of all of their Christmas decor so definitely check them out the other takeaway from Marshalls is that they are the perfect place to find something to put together a hostess gift whether it's like a pre-packaged thing that they just have there ready for you to purchase or little elements of like a gift basket that you could put together from chocolates to decor they even have like the gift tags and the gift wrap really really good place to find that and it's so much more affordable than anywhere that i've seen but we're gonna head into michael's now and see what they have Haley, are you ready to go do some christmas shopping yeah, yeah. okay let's go in Haley, can you say hi, Santa? Is he cute? Do you like the Santa Claus? Look at this. 
so it looks like Michael's doesn't have like their full Christmas stock out. I'm used to seeing a little bit more, but it might be because I'm so early in the year. It's nothing compared to Marshall's, but what they lack in stock, they make up for in smells because it smells amazing in here, like cinnamon. But they have lots of cute stuff. I'm seeing a ton of red and black that seems to be really popular this year. So like they have these buffalo check um, throws, which they seem pretty thin. They're $45, so even at 40% off, um, they're still more expensive than the ones that I saw at Marshall's, but these are all like packaged up with a ribbon, so if you were looking for a gift, this would be a good option. But again, they have all of this red and black buffalo check, red and black over there, it's everywhere. Even Santa's looking pretty hipster in his red and black Hello. buffalo check. You want to see Santa Claus again? I see boxes here and the ladder. They're going to be stocking these shelves a little bit more. Look at those. Do you know what those are? Nutcrackers. <gasps> yep, just pull the lever on the back. Good job. So there's a bunch of stock over there, over there. I'm just a little early, I think. But what they do have out is really cute, just a lot of red, white, and black. I'm much more of a green, white, and black when it comes to Christmas decor. I don't do a ton of red, but I like a pop of red here and there, definitely. I think this is what I'm smelling. I think these little pine cones have a good smell. Can I smell? Yeah, you can smell. Nummy. Nummy. So I don't remember seeing this here before, but they have a lot of like mini Christmas trees and Christmas floral. I remember seeing like poinsettias and stuff, but not all of these Christmas trees. They even have little flocked ones, these cute little ones with like Santa belts on them. So that's cute. And these are actually pretty affordable. So with especially the 40% off, um, you can get some really cute Christmas greenery. Sit down, sit down, sit down. My child doesn't want to sit in the cart anymore. They have little garlands and picks, so I love these gold ones. How pretty is that? Those are so pretty. Look at that. Oh my goodness, like Candy Cane Lane with these. Those are pretty cool looking. Oh, and look, they have little elf feet. Definitely more selection, I think, in the floral no, no. section for like specifically Christmas floral. So I think I'm gonna get a couple of these uh, picks so that I can put them in my tree because the ones that I've had for seven years are getting a bit worn out. Since red is so popular, I think I am gonna add some more red to my tree and these berries they're so pretty. Always need more of these. And then I love this idea, making your own Christmas ornaments. That is really fun. Oh, they even have like little chalkboard Christmas ornaments. So I'm gonna keep this in mind for like a craft with the kids. Yeah, for fun. You can draw like chalk stuff on them. Okay, let's not drop the stuff. Oh, look, Mom. Daddy Warbucks Scarecrow. He's discount Daddy Warbucks now. So you guys, now is the perfect time for Michaels to purchase their discount fall decor. So if fall decor didn't really fit into your budget this year, but you have some to spend, now is the time because they're 70% off. So the stuff that I was looking at in my last um, shop with me video for the fall decor, it's so dirt cheap right now. So they have this whole section um, at my store of just a ton of stuff that fits into the fall category that you could use all year round. That's really cheap now because it was in the fall category. Christmas countdown, how cute is that? So cute. Empty shelves waiting for more Christmas stock. This is a great place to get um, ornaments. Very, very cheap. So in their wreath making aisle, which is where I'm at. They have even more florals and picks and stuff, so this is a good place if you like to put little like floral picks or something sparkly in the leaves or the branches of your Christmas tree. These are really cute. I love this rose gold, um, but I am noticing that a lot of their gold stuff is very almost greenish yellow, so not really my style. I'm definitely more on the champagne side of gold um, or like a rose gold girl. Look at these. Those are sparkly. So pretty. 
and welcome to the mini haul. I have Haley in the kitchen over there, so you're gonna hear her babbling, and the boys are doing quiet time right now. Um, I did go to Bath and Body Works, but I didn't really film a shop with me because it would have been me just sniffing candles the whole time. I only picked up a couple of things there, which I'll show you. Also, they were blasting the music, and I knew that if I shared any footage, um, with the audio, this video might get taken down. We don't want that to happen. So um, let's start with the Bath and Body Works uh, little part of this haul and then we'll move on to Marshalls and Michaels. Just so you know, everything that I can find online, I will have links for you guys. And then some of the Marshall stuff is kind of difficult to find online. So I will link like similar items for you. Here's the little bag. I explained in my last Shop With Me video that I like to do um, scented hand soap and a scented candle just in my guest bathroom right there because it's also the kids bathroom and it gets kind of stinky in there even though I try to keep it as clean as possible. So I got this vanilla bean Noel and it was three for 15, um, which I probably should have picked up a couple of others, but this is the only one that I wanted to get right now. And then I also got this candle, which it smells like the inside of Michael's. You know how I was telling you guys that um, Michael's smelled amazing. Well, if you go to Bath and Body Works, you can smell this candle. Yes, you can smell. It smells good. It does smell good. This is the smell of Michael's in a candle, and it's great. And typically, I don't do any synthetic fragrances in my home, um, but it is the holiday season, so I'm gonna indulge a little bit, but the main reason I do it is just for guests, to have it be welcoming and good smelling, and I honestly haven't had any negative effects um, health-wise from just having it in my guest bathroom. And all of their three wick candles, the full retail price, if there's no deal or anything, is $24.50, but they had them, the Christmas ones specifically, on sale for ten dollars each which is actually cheaper than the ones that I saw either at Marshall's um, which some of those have really good scents or Michael's and the Michael's ones I don't really like so this is definitely the better way to go just in my opinion as far as like quality goes and how how long the candles last and how good they smell I thought the vanilla bean Noel and the cinnamon and clove buds candle were a good duo for the bathroom smells so so good okay so on to michael's i just took everything out of the bag and i only got a couple of things here first of all this little um jingle bells this is a door hanger um i thought this would be cute with my wreath that i have just to jingling when someone comes through my door and all of their stuff at michael's was 40 percent off um, also always need some of these uh, Christmas ornament hooks. I pretty much get a new package every year. I probably already have some, but I don't wanna like open my Christmas tree tote and find that I need some. I've done that before. So I've learned my lesson. I paid the, you know, 40% off $2 and got a pack of those. And then you guys saw me pick out these red picks. These berry picks are so pretty. And if they work well in my tree, I might just pick up some more. So we shall see. I got four of them. Full price on these is $4. So what is that? $2.40 a pick, if my math serves me right. Um, with that 40% off all Christmas stuff. And then these bigger branches with that gold on it, I couldn't pass these up. I actually had some of these a while ago and I loved them in my tree. Um, these are normally $10 and they're a good size um, branch. And so 40% off of that, they went down to $6 each. So I got three of those. And then in their discount fall stuff, I just couldn't resist getting one of these flannel backed, um, Haley's jingling the bell here, tablecloth. I use these for crafts with the kids cause they wipe off so well. Um, but they're not just like a cheapy plastic tablecloth that will get ripped easily. So this is a good way to go. These were 70% off and what's the price on these? Oh, 70% off of $8. So you do the math, but didn't spend very much at all at Michael's and I got some things that I'll definitely be using. On to Marshall's and this is where I picked up the most, but still it's just a few items. First of all, how beautiful is this book? It's actually quite heavy. This was $7.99. It's a treasury of Christmas stories and songs and it's a hardback book with this beautiful cover and it has like metallic on it and it just has beautifully illustrated um, stories, Christmas songs. It's just 
so pretty. I love that. And I love that it includes the true story of Christmas. Very cool. Next, I picked up an alternate towel. Yes, I picked up the same one as my mom. I actually asked her. I was like, mom, do you mind if I have the same bathroom towel? I saw the other ones that they had available and there was just a lot of red and some patterns that weren't really like my style. Um, and you guys know my favorite color is gray. <laughs> That's what my mom was doing when she was showing me that gray uh, plaid blanket because she knows that too. And I asked my mom if she would mind if I had the same bathroom towel in my house as she did since she picked up one of these. And she was like, yeah, no way. I don't care at all. Go ahead. And then, of course, we have the adorable hedgehog blanket. It's actually um, one side is this hedgehog print and then the other side is this super cozy uh, little like faux Sherpa. Very, very cute. And this was 15 bucks. Honestly, Marshall's is the best place to get throws, pillows. I mean, like towels. Any of this is way cheaper there than it is at Target. And then when you can find their stuff on clearance, like at the end of the season, even better. You see that? That's so cute. And speaking of hedgehogs, oh my gosh, look at this little guy. Isn't he so cute? So he doesn't scream Christmas to me. I'm still looking out for like a Christmas hedgehog, but that scarf, he fits into the like the winter theme and I couldn't pass them up, so super cute. This will probably be in my uh, holiday Christmas coffee favorites video, so be looking out for that. And then the last thing that I got, and I showed you guys this while I was shopping, the uh, wrapping paper. Can't beat the prices of Marshalls, even at Costco. It's still cheaper to go the Marshalls route, especially, like I said before, kind of goes without saying, but if you shop at the end of the season and find stuff on clearance, I've done that before. I've gone to Marshalls and Hobby lobby and grab stuff on Christmas clearance for like 90% off. Um, but I needed it now. And so I got it $3.99 or $2.99 for these pretty good size rolls of, um, wrapping paper. This is all that I need. I actually purchased extra more than probably what I will use this year, but you could even wrap birthday gifts throughout the whole year in this gingham uh, color and then I just wanted the little Christmas trees to add a pop of like quintessential Christmas time. Oh, I lied. I, that's not it. I did pick up one more thing, but this isn't specifically Christmas decor. You guys probably saw it in the other parts of the video. Um, I have another one of these. This is the Lodge brand um, enameled cast iron seven quart Dutch oven. I have a red one, which you guys have seen in so many videos. Um, it's like my favorite piece of cookware. I've had that red one since before Weston and I were married. It was the first registry gift that we received um, when we were engaged, which was so sweet. But I registered for a black one, I believe. And the person who gave us that one just got us the red one, which red isn't really my style. It's not really my color. And it's given me seven years of use. It still works like it's brand new. But since my kitchen is pretty much all white and black and gray, um, and I do videos like surrounding cooking and stuff like that, um, I have had my eyes out for a gray one of these Dutch ovens for close to a year. I literally have a Google search alert when one goes for sale. They're really hard to find for whatever reason. I have found some over the last several months that are like $150. Apparently this color is really sought after and I wasn't willing to pay that much. And I found this one at Marshall's and there were several others there and other colors too for 59, which is a great deal. You can find that price on Amazon, but for colors that I don't necessarily like. So I held out and I'm so glad that I did. It was the first thing I picked up when I was there. I was like, I know this isn't Christmas decor, but I have been searching for this. I'm so excited that I found this, even though it's not Christmassy, but I just thought I'd alert you guys if you're looking for a good deal on the lodge, especially the seven quart. That's like the bigger version. I think it's the biggest one they make. Marshalls or TG Maxx, check them out. So that is everything that I have for you guys in this video. That's everything that I picked up. I hope you guys enjoyed the shop with me portion of this video. On my Instagram, you guys also requested that I go to Hobby Lobby to Target. There was tons of requests for that, like in the dollar spot and then also at the Dollar Tree. But 
the Hobby Lobby, Target, and Dollar Trees in my area really don't have very much Christmas in stock at all. But I will be going over on my Instagram, and if I head into the, any of those stores and they have some good stock that I can show you, I'll be doing like little mini shop with me, little Instagram stories. So check me out over there, at Natalie Bennett Vlogs. I'd love it if you'd follow. And in case no one has told you yet, here is the permission that you need to not keep up with the Joneses this year during the holiday season. It's not necessary to go into debt or to overspend just to make our houses look cute and pretty for the holiday season. You can reuse decor, you can make it yourself, or you can definitely have it be more minimal. That's my mindset about things, and I feel like it's so much more freeing because I don't feel the pressure to have all of the new stuff and to go out and buy all of the stuff just to be like the other people that I see on social media. So keep that in mind when you're doing a little bit of window shopping. Be encouraged. If you're excited for the holiday season, then don't don't forget to subscribe because I do have more clean and decorate with me videos. I have some holiday Christmas videos coming out for you guys and I would love it so much if you were here for them. Turn on that bell button so you don't miss my regular Monday videos like this one as well as the bonus videos that I've been throwing in there. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you are. Thank you so much for spending a little part of your day here with me. Be sure before you leave to check out some of my other videos and I'll catch you later.